talk about taking a really shitty, shitty cup and polishing that new. Hey guys, this is my review for the first episode of season 13 of Supernatural. If any of you guys watched my videos, the last few videos talking about season 12 and what was going to happen in this season, you would know that I had some dissatisfaction with the last season. And at least to say I was not going into this one with much hope. However, the first episode is better than both season 12 and season 11's opener. And season 11 turned out to be fantastic. Season 12, not so much. But this was actually a really cool episode. We started off by meeting Jack, who is the son of Lucifer, and he did this weird thing on Sam and Dean. They woke up the next day. Uh, he's walking around being naked and trying to figure out stuff, and that was actually kind of an aspect that I thought was, it was just run of the an episode of the week characters. And yeah, they were. They basically just were like, man, oh, monsters exist, okay, whatever. And they were come and gone, and they were just gone with. They were not the focus. What was the focus was Dean and Sam coming to the realization that Gaz is dead. Yeah, I'm gonna wait to see how that turns out. But in the sense of actually addressing the elephant into the room, they actually did this with both respect, with actual care to the character as well as an emotional depth there's a scene where the brothers are in the car and dean's like he's dead he's gone and the pyre scene at the end was so good as jack wonders why they're doing why do you say goodbye why do you say you're sorry and sam lists all these things you say you're sorry you say thank you they hope that they've gone to a better place place that's something better and you say goodbye and it was so interesting seeing that because as we know, we don't really know what happens to the angels after they die. I don't know if they go back to heaven or if they die, die. And that was really interesting as the unknown factor in it. You could see that on Sam's face. And then Sam, or Dean acknowledges that Crowley, Kelly, and their mom are all gone. Also going back, that the angels want to use the Nephilim. They want to use him for tools. They, he can do anything, supposedly. And that's a tool that they're going to have to work with in this season. Because you now basically have a second god. So you have to figure out how to nerf, not nerf your characters, but keep them still in a range of danger with a basic god on their side. But that was interesting how they acknowledged that Crowley's gone. And they also had the scene where Dean was ta trying to talk to Chuck, and he was like, S bring these people back, and we knew it wasn't going to happen, but still, again, in a very emotional part, there was a lot of emotion in this episode. There was a lot of really cool, in-depth moments with the characters, something that I thought was really not going to happen, and the pacing and the setup was good. It was this episode. They weren't setting up everything else, they were just focusing on this episode. And not in a bad way in terms of like a filler episode or anything. This was focused on what mattered and the brothers and the relationship with Jack. However, the pyre scene is kind of ruined with a super, super fake CG fire. That was kind of bad. Also, they come to the conclusion that their mother is dead. Yet we go to the alternate reality and we see that Lucifer doesn't want to kill Mary. And she makes this face of like, oh no, I'm in terrible trouble. And that was kind of my face. I'm like, oh god, they're still going with the mother character. So that was a bit of a downside for me. As well as the fire. The fire was terrible. But either way, this was actually a really good season opener. It doesn't build up to what's going to happen for the rest of the season, really. But it really shows a lot of depth into a character that is going to have a big impact on this season. And, like I said, the relationship with the brothers, their interactions in this episode, their emotional moments, their depths were actually quite genuine. So in the end, I'm going to give the season opener of season 13 of Supernatural 
a 5 out of 7. I think it was okay. I liked it. It's a good setup. Not as big of a setup as I would have liked, but I said the, as I said earlier, the focus was dead on on what needed to be done. And everything was pretty good, except for the ending, because I, I really was hoping they'd drop that freaking storyline with the mother. But either way, that's all that I can say about this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. And like I said, I will be reviewing the rest of the episodes of this season as they come. So... Here we go again for the third time on this channel. We're going to be reviewing every single season episode. Oh, here we go. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later.